The Owen James Report is brought to you by JMMB. If you're serious about saving, you deserve JMMB. Donna! Hi, Sophie! I brought my friend to set up her plan. Donna Hi! Decided. This is so wonderful. <laughs> From the moment we walked in, I felt really at home. I'm my glad. financial planner was so easy to talk to. She understands me and know what I want. I feel like she really wants me to achieve my goals. It's easy. I am happy. You deserve people who really stand for you. You deserve JMNB. Welcome to the family. If you're serious about saving, you deserve a JMMB. Good evening. This is the Owen James Report. Oh, yes. 35 year old Barita Investments is Jamaica's oldest stockbroking company, and as a mark of respect, the Jamaica Stock Exchange invited Barita's founder and chairman, Rita Humphreys Lewin, to ring the opening bell today. Mrs. Lewin blames government policies of the 70s and the 90s for the lack of growth in the stock market, which in 1969 had over 60 members and today has less than 50. The policies that emerged eventually after that, which was basically the high interest rate regime, has really helped to destroy this industry. And um, the people, you'll find now that the investors are not as inclined to take on the risk of equity. They are very secure in the government people. Here are today's foreign exchange numbers. The benchmark U.S. dollar traded at an average selling rate of $89.85, down one Jamaican cent. However, the Canadian dollar traded at $91.91 .91 Jamaican, up 87 cents Jamaican. Sterling closed 65 Jamaican cents higher at $143.73. News on the market now and gains by couriers NCB and Scotia Group triggered advances in the Jamaican stock market indices today. The main JC index advanced by 672 points or 7 tenths of 1%. 22 stocks traded with 11 advancing, 6 declining and 5 holding firm. The winners included Caribbean producers, Carreras, DNG, Kingston Wharves, Lasco Distributors, NCB, Scotia Group, and Scotia Investments. The losers included Berger, Grace Kennedy, JMMB, and Proven Investments. Now finally, in our business intelligence feature, every successful business has one key reason for its success. I spoke with Jamaica's first lady of investing, Rita Humphreys Lewin, today. What has contributed to your longevity in business? Well, we have a philosophy, I have a philosophy, that the client's money is not yours to play with. It must be properly invested, and if you say you have bought government stocks, that you Still in business intelligence, a team from the Jamaica Stock Exchange is in Haiti helping to jumpstart the country's fledgling stock exchange. Indications are that the team's success could help Jamaica's market. That's the Owen James Report. Good evening. The Owen James Report was brought to you by JMMB. If you're serious about saving, you deserve JMMB.